literally about three days ago, I got an email from Chaos Cards and all the email said was Ando, we've sent you an absolutely massive package regarding your favourite Pokemon product of 2019. Then check out what just arrived at my front door. I think in today's video, we have one of the most epic unboxings for us today. But like what's inside, you can't even rattle it, but it's so heavy. Alright, so we got one thing to do, and that's to pretty much crack this thing open. Oh yes, dude, I thought it was! It's none other than I- What the flip? Look at this, it's a case full of the uh, collector's chest. I didn't even know they made case for collector's chest. There is nine collector's chests. No, seriously, this actually may be the craziest Unlist of Leaf video I think we're gonna record for the rest of the year. Look at this, this is, no oh no. This right here, plus the two on the floor, is nine collector's chests. Oh my goodness. So I think to start today's video off, I'm gonna give a massive shout out and thank you to Chaos Cards. I've got a 5% off discount code, so if you guys wanna buy the chest or any other Pokemon cards, make sure you use my code for 5% off. And also, the Legends just started a community Facebook page, which is the coolest thing ever. So if you want to like talk Pokemon cards on Facebook or whatever, I'll link their community page in the description below. Um, but yeah, Chaos Cards, what the heck guys? I think today, we should legitimately open 9 collector's chests and see what the pulls are like if you did this. So hopefully this gives you guys a bit of a better idea of what nine collector's chest looks like, but without further ado, I'm gonna time lapse this, and I'm gonna open every single one, get the promos out, and the boosters, cause you get a lot of stuff inside of here. Guys, I think I made the craziest discovery ever. So I was casually unboxing them, all right? We're all done now. But you get greeted. If you haven't seen my unboxing of these tins, by the way, go check it out. You, like, the tins are basically the coolest lunchbox ever. Clone, like, Charizard, Armored Mewtwo. Then you get the Clone Charizard and Armored Mewtwo cards here, including Holo Pikachu and Chibi Art Form Mew, right? So when you open up the tin, the first thing you see are these cards. I unboxed one of them, pulled off the cards, there was this. They accidentally inserted a blank one. So does that mean some of the tins come with just nothing? Because it literally went, I just pulled this out of the tin, then boom, there was that bonus Mew coin with no promo cards. That's trippy as. So maybe you got caught in the machine or something. But yeah, one of them was like a two for one deal right there. So we got all of these promos right here, which if you guys want to give away these bad boys, let me know in the comments. But I'm thinking a big Christmas thing with uh, all of these promos. But that's going to look so sick. I'm definitely going to take a couple, put it in the binder. But the rest I reckon we might do a giveaway or something. Now the booster packs. What boosters do you get inside of a collector's chest? Let's have a look. Flip it upside down. I think we're dealing with a lot of new sets, so Cosmic Eclipse, Cosmic Eclipse, and then these are the three. Team Up, which is interesting, Guardians Rising and Evolutions. Is Guardians Rising in every single one? So here we got like two Team Ups, and then on this one it's Team Up, yeah, Guardians Rising and Evolutions. Alright, so there you find boosters. We've got a, <laughs> look at this stack, it's ridiculous! So we've got a big stack right there, and then basically if you haven't seen my unboxing of the uh, lunchbox, you get a bunch of, oh, Get a bunch of pencils so you can write down all your fabulous GX polls, and I'll show you where to write them down in a second. Get those out. Then you get some stickers. Mew, Mewtwo, and Pikachu. Then as I pull that one off, you got Armored Mewtwo and Clone Charizard stickers as well. Everyone's a fan of Charizard. And then as you pull that one off, you've got your notepad to write down all of these amazing full arts you're about to pull out the boosters. But then there's one more item, which I think they didn't even have to include, but they did. None other than a flipping binder. Dude, they chucked in a mini album right here. So this Mew, Mewtwo, and Pikachu mini album, it's basically the same artwork as the lunchbox, but you can store your promo cards. Like, dude, your full arts, your hollows, but you can also like whatever pulls you get inside of there. How good is these? These tins are fantastic. Anyway, let's find out what the pulls would be if you opened up nine of these collector's chests. Alrighty guys, I hope everybody is ready. Hopefully you're sitting down with an absolutely massive bag of popcorn right now because we're about to unbox nine different stacks of uh, all these collector's chests, I guess. And that rhymes, but we'll see. Which one has the best pulls? I got a feeling like, if anything to go by is the unboxing that we did early in the week, 
These pools should actually be pretty decent, but when I say that, usually we don't get the best stuff, so let's just see how we go. What on earth have they done here? It's like a bark chip got in the way of the photocopier machine, that's actually on the cart. Anyway, electric type energy, we're gonna throw Dartrix, we're gonna Whalemer as well, Palper Toad, come on, let's set the tone for these epic treasure tins. Let's make Pirates of the Caribbean proud by getting a regular egg ground on. It's alright, another Cosmic Eclipse. The weird part I guess about these tins right now, you only get two of the brand new set Cosmic and the rest is a bit of a free for all with like Team Up and Crimson Invasion and all that, but hopefully the pools in those sets will actually be pretty decent and get stuff we haven't seen before. So we got Love Esther, Sneasel, we're gonna Meowth as well, good old routes, and then none other than a Sylveon to finish it off. Alright, on to the uh, older sets, but not too old. Pokemon Sun and Moon team up. The set that everyone likes collecting, I think, now, as soon as it went out of print, it just became all the rage, and everyone's like, oh, I always like Team Up, let me collect booster boxes of it, which pushed the price up of these boxes to, like, I think they're going for about $200 now, which is pretty insane. So we've got a Bronzor, got a Klefki as well, Pidgey, here we go, a Mulga, Voltorb! You, we're not gonna, we're, we're literally not gonna end the first tin with nothing at all, because that would be actually disgusting. What do, oh, okay, it's a uh, Guardian. Oh, Guardians Rising. It's not Crimson Invasion, is it? Come on, Guardians Rising. Let's break you open right here. Pull you to the side. No way. It's a Sun and Moon, and that was a solid green code. Okay. Darkness type energy. Vanillish. Enhanced Hammer. Trubbish. Got a March Up as well. Geo Dude. Mud Bray. Then we've got. There is no way. There is no way on the first collect, especially after the chest that we opened on the channel earlier this week, this is gonna come through and give us nothing. You were what? Like, literally, you guys saw this right now, didn't you? You're watching the same video I'm watching. Slowbro, Super Potion, Volpix, Darkness Dart, Magic Up, Way. Uh, not Whale Lord, Weedle, Nine Tails Break Card is literally the only thing that we pulled for the entire chest opening. You are playing with my uncle SpaghettiOs right now. All right, Nine Tails Break, you are cool, but a lot of people don't actually like break cards that much, so let's hope on the second chest today we can get something else. I was here thinking that like, I was preparing myself just before, I'm like, all right, Endo, get ready, get ready to pull that Charizard, get ready to get the, you know, Arceus Trophy card out of Cosmic, and then you go get a couple full arts out of Team Up. I'm sitting here like a chump. I just pulled a Nine Tails Break card out of a whole chest. All right, the second one surely has to do us a little better, doesn't it? With a regular rare Macargo. Blastoise, I had really good luck with you with the Advent Calendar yesterday. You have gotta tell me right now. That we're like best buddies, okay? I endorse the old boost pack art. So time to give us uh, some GX cards in return, I reckon. So we got a water type energy, love Esther, Anarith, Gloom as well. Two cards there, Swirlix, Grimer, then we're gonna Slugma, Chin Chow, Cosmog, there, oh gosh, that's not good. It's a regular rare Ursa Ring, Gengar, and Mimikyu time. Oh. Probably one of my more favorite uh, pack arts right there. So there's the code card. I'm praying you guys are doing better than me in the codes right now. So we've got a fire type energy. Can this please be a summary of the pulls? Pure flames. Hitmonlee. A Squirtle as well. Klefki. Got a Voltorb. Weedle. One of these chests have to come through, don't they? What is going on? I promise right now, what you're watching is literally... Oh my gosh. There's no, there's no words for what's happening right now. How can it be this crazily bad at the moment? Fighting type energy? Uh, then we've got, especially like, I guess I wouldn't be as perplexed if we didn't have the chest opening we did recently. Christmas Deli Bird, love that card. Uh, then we've got Halo. And then none other than our first GX of this entire chest opening. It's Tapa Lele GX card. Really miscut too, like really bulky down the bottom. What is going on? This is so hectic. Okay, Tapa Lele GX card right there. Then we only have one more booster, which is an Evolutions out of the entire second chest. All right, it's a Raichu too. 
Everyone still loves the uh, Charizard reprint. Oh gosh, reprint card that you can get out of the set. More people I talk to, everyone always says, Andrew, you can do another booster box of evolutions because I want to see you get another Charizard. What do you guys think? Leave a comment in the comment section below if I should open up another booster box of evolutions. I don't know why, that text seemed a bit small. Got a Sandshrew, got a Weedle as well, Tangler, got a Ponita, Doduo, Maintenance. That's pretty good. Pidgeot EX. Pidgeot's always been one of my more favorite Pokemon, so I'm definitely going to take a nice gold boarded EX card right there. Throwing it back all the way to the EX days too. So we're getting better. I feel like it's massaging us into like a better territory right now. Because it was like, you know what? Start off with a break card. Then I'll give you an EX and a GX. Now this third chest. This is where it's going to get extra spicy right now. Put the wrapper to the side. There's the codes. Let's go four from the back. It's good old Cosmic. Got a fighting type right now. Ooh, this card attached to the back. Bishop. Torkoal. We've got Gloom as well. Rufflet. Bim plop. Got a Vulpix, then we're gonna rock rough as well. Stuff all dust goal. Oh no. <laughs> Maybe I need to go the other way. Maybe I need to start by unboxing the three on the side. And then we'll uh, try and do the two on the other side, the brand new cosmic sets. Got water type, Lilip, Jolteon, Magnemite, Lillipup, Trap Inch as well, Sneasel, got a Sphil, and then This is hectic ads. I wonder why it doesn't give us really good stuff out of Cosmic at the moment. Oh, the, leave a comment in the comment section below. Have you guys opened up a chest and what sort of pulls did you get out the cosmic boosters? Was it not good or was it actually really decent? I've just got a weird like case right now. That being said, I've never opened a case of chests in my life. So today's episode is a first for me. I just, um, yeah. I would have thought we had a more concentrated ratio, but we'll see how we go. There's the code card again. That was a oh, sun and moon, so it's four for the back. Here we go. Metal type energy, enhanced hammer, good old Glalie, then slowpoke, or oh, washy washy, this time not a GX guard. You're kidding. This is hectic as. All right, Vanillux. Let's go for evolutions. It's a Charizard. Surely that means something. Surely that means we can summon some sort of oh, good holo card, I want to say. Not even just an EX card. Let's get a base set holo reprint. Got a Machoke, Full Hill, Venusaur, Spirit Link, we got a Weedle, Electabuzz, Drowsy. Then we got, oh, Star U. Reverse Slow Bro. Okay, this is actually happening. L Ladies and gentlemen, I, I have a feeling you may be watching a couple of the worst collector's chests ever to be opened. Oh my goodness. This could all be basically turned around if I get some sort of ridiculous pull, but like, holy smokes. Metal type energy right here. Then we're going to Mawile, Dusclops as well, Love Vesta. I'm just thinking in terms of how much the chest costs. Like, it's pretty cool you get all the promos right. But you would hope some of the boosters have something cool inside. We've got the babies now. Oh, <laughs> this is hectic as... Was it just a dud day over at the Pokemon factory and they accidentally forgot to hit press generate EX ball? That's not bad. Generate the EX button? I think so. My name is Jeff. He didn't press the button. Alright, Lillipop, Trap Inch, Sunflora. Team Up car, oh, gosh. Two regular races to start that one off. There we go, that Team Up code was switched around. Love when they do that. I don't have to switch the code cards around the other way. Got an electric type. Forest, Electro Charger, Pidgey, Nidoran, Magikarp as well, Poochiana. This is not happening. This is, oh my goodness. Do these boosters, like the rest of the chest boosters, probably need to go in a museum? Unlistedly found the pile of cases that forgot to have good poles inside. We got a Unlisted Leaf Energy, Machoke. Watchhog, Volpix, Gothita, Chansey, Pet Lil, Helioptile. Oh my goodness me. Here's the evolutions pack. Now, come on. You're gonna give us anything. I don't actually care what it is at this point. Misty's Determination, kind of looks like and feels like me right now. Ponida, Nidoran, Seal. Another one. Oh my, this is like an expose right now. Let's do the next one. How many do we have left? One, two. We've only got four left after this. 
Oh, wow. Please demolish the like button and help me sleep tonight. Otherwise, I think I legitimately may cry myself to sleep tonight. Oh, no, the code's... This, um... Cameron's about to run out of battery. We got this, though. Let's finish this boost pack first. Tropius, Togedemaru. We got an Eevee. Duskull as well. Time Pole. Flip, 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 flip. Raichu. Ray Dilly. Regular rare. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't know what to tell you other than... You guys have to tell me something. Like, I... I don't have a single word for this moment. Motivation is dwindling. I feel like I'm running on empty right now. Okay, let's go forth in the back. Keep it positive, guys. Keep a big smile on the face and hope for the best. Okay, so we've got a pig knight. Then we got... Oh, no. I think that was another... Dare I say it? Dude, I saw it. I saw the end of the card and I was like, no. That's another regular rare, isn't it? It's wheezing, and if I learned anything from yesterday's advent calendar, wheezing goes through your trash because it smells funny. So little Timmy, take out your trash, okay? <sighs> oh no! Did I actually do that? You, there's no way. There is, like, I, it, it almost feels like I've, I don't know, somehow rigged it to go all bad pulls or something, but that's not even possible! I don't think you could even make something be this bad. Wow, okay, evolution's time. Let's break that one there. And you guys get a uh, evolution's code. Then that's three from the back, I think it is. Yep, X and Y. Swing it around. <laughs> Do you guys see that code? Hopefully not. Coughing, Diglett, Seal, Nidoran, Ponida, Doduo, Volpix. This is not happening. This is... Feels like I'm probably still dreaming this. Norlax and Eevee. Team up. The code card was switched around. Please. I will take a hollow at this point. I don't actually understand what's happening. Um. Ponida, Cosmog, Voltorb. I actually don't understand what's happening. Let's do another one. We've got three to go after this and that's it. Um. Please, Arceus, I don't know what I did. Did I, did I step on your feet? Did I leave Lego out and you trod on it last night when you're trying to make your cheese toasty? Something went wrong, obviously. If you guys are still watching this, let me know in the comment section below. Leave a comment, like, the Red Power Ranger eats wholemeal bread. And I know who stuck it out with me, because these are the real hours right now. Whoever's watching this take place. I somehow just feel like it's going to make it up to me by just doing something insane at any moment, but... It just sort of digs itself further and further into its own hole. Tag Call, Delphamize, Slugma, Chinchow, Cosmog, Pancham, Drillbur. Dude. Bravery, regular, rare. I'm perplexed how something like this um, goes down, but okay. Four from the back, then we got a Psychic type. Brock's Grit, Flaffy, Voltorb, Cosmog, Ponida. Grimer, here we go, Dratini. Oh my goodness, our first GX in what feels like years, but it's Latias and Latios GX God right there. Absolute beast, really, really nice tag team. I think everyone loves that one. Look at that Buster Purge and Arrow unit. Really cool name for an attack, but let's put this GX at the back. It's gonna be a small recap. I'm gonna put it that way. Open you guys up. Put you to the side. There's the code card. And let's go four from the back, I think it is. And then we've got Darkness Type Energy, Brooklet Hill, Gliscor, Sandshrew, Machop, Chansey, Snow Runt, Pancham. Wow. Okay. The next one is done. It's Venusaur time. Evolution's time. Rip you off. Put you to the side. There's the code. Three. And the final booster out of this bad boy. I just need to tidy up all of these Pokemon cards, because there's a lot. I think I worked it out. We're supposed to be opening around like 45-ish boosters today. Growlithe, Marchop. Yes, a Charizard! Whoa, nearly fell off the chair. Oh, no way, guys. That's actually really, really cool. Not only a Charizard, but a Mega Charizard EX with Crimson Dive with 300 right there. Honestly, guys, these Charizards are like so popular. Everyone loves buying them. Everyone loves collecting them. So that is an absolutely amazing pull right there. Mega Charizard EX, and let's continue. 
on to the third to last case. And I think after this one, I'm going to have to tidy up all of this stuff. Because look at this. This is how many cards we've opened. And uh, <laughs> I don't want to show you how many EXs and GXs we pulled out of all that. So let's swing. Oh, this is good. This is good. I saw my first white and green code in years. Okay. So we've got a water type energy. Vimbrava. Probably pass. Apom. Got a Woo Bat. Ducklet. Swirlix. Grimer. Togi Tomorrow. Nice. That's the first look at a holy card I've seen in a hot minute. Gallade. I'll put you at the back. Can I dare ask for another one? Soul Galu and Lunala. Always really nice back cards. There's the uh, code card for you guys right now. Four from the back. And then we've got. Unlisted Leaf Energy to start things off. Always a good sign. We got Chaotic Swirl, Tangler, Eevee, Duskull, Fuller, Reverse, Extra Drill right there. We're looking really good. Then a regular rare Wolverine. <sighs> That's not too bad. I still get around with Fuller Reverses. I don't, honestly don't care what people say. I find them cool. Um, I know they don't sell for heaps and heaps of money, but... And I know people don't like them for some reason, but they're still... I reckon the artwork's pretty cool. Okay, three boosters to go. Then we've done with another chest. Let's open up this team up. Put you to the side. There we go. And let's get this party started. We got a Psyche type energy. Then a Hitmonchan. Jasmine. Then Joltik. Blitzel. Squirtle. Tentacle. Grimer. We're just going to pretend we didn't get a regular air muck right there. Oh no, what are you doing running away? Guardians Rising. You've got to have something. The way he just like sort of bolted right there. Then we go right there, then we go four, swing it around, we got a fire type energy to start things off, then a Graveler, then two different trainer cards, Marchop, Fletchling, two Volpixes as well, and a Shop Hito Regular Rare. Surely with two double ups, two hashtag Illuminati confirms, there had to be something. Evolution's time, there's the code card. Three from the back, Charizard, if I can summon you, now would definitely be the time to show your face. Diglett, Drowsy, Caterpie as well, Doduo, and then... <gasps> yes, it's come through, oh my goodness! It only took five years! We did it! Full art, gold boarded, flipping new too! Yes! Oh, that's so sick! Energy absorption, regeneration, and cyburn. Oh. Dude, that is such an awesome card. Okay, you know what? My, uh, my view on these collector's chests is slowly getting restored. My faith is coming back. I was in a dark place for a while there, but woo! We did it! I'm so excited. Alright, you know what? I gotta tidy up all these Pokemon cards, and then we'll do the last two booster packs from the tins. This is insane. What is going on? I don't know. Arceus, if I've ever asked you about one thing, it's to please bless the following two collector's tins slash treasure tins slash collector's chests. I don't know what they're called, but something along those lines. And you have to bless the final two lot of these booster packs. Is everyone sitting down? I just want to make sure everyone's ready. Because from what I just witnessed, it's all going to come down to the final two. For me to have got the pulls that I did on the booster pack, I mean the tin opening that we did early in the week, it leads me to think one in every case, one tin in every case of nine tins has absolutely ridiculous pulls that are so off the charts, it convinces everyone else to go buy one. That's not a prime example, that good old drumper right there. But we got a Blast Toys. Now me and Blast Toys, we're tight, especially after yesterday's advent, so I'm sure this one's going to have the goods. There's the code card. Let's go four from the back. Second to last. Collector's chest opening. Dusk Lobs, Love Vesta, Volpix as well. Got a Rockruff, Stuffle, Rowlet. We're going to fans up. And then Wishy Washy, Full Art Reverse card. Regular Red Glalie. You know what? I'm going to take a Reverse Full Art. All good in the hood. Put you at the back. And then our second to last team up. Kinda sad, we come to the end, that was actually, you know, it went way too fast, but I think the whole time I was just getting more, like, mad and mad. <laughs> it was pretty funny, okay. I don't, I still don't know what we did, I'm so keen to watch this back. We got a Jinx, Hitmonlee, got a Poochiana, then, please let me know, these team ups aren't all bad. Clef Key, and a Bill's Analysis. It's giving us good stuff, but not amazing stuff. I'm still hyped as on that full up Mewtwo card though. Oh gee whiz, Guardians Rising. What are you doing? No, get off the cards. You can't be on there all your life. Come on, Boost Back Rapper. Jeez, clingy as. Guardians Rising, I know what it's doing. 
There's the code card. Let's go for... And then we've just got one evolutions. Okay, fighting type energy. Matang, Whimsicott as well. Vulpix, Slowpoke, Machop, Helioptail, Murkrow. Then Lu We've bought so many of those regular rare Lunalas. There's the evolutions. It's a Raichu once again. Put you to the side and sure is on. Let's do it on the finale. The second to last evolutions. Porygon, de-evolution spray. Ghastly, Sandshrew, Weedle, Tangela, Raticate. That's not bad. Mewtwo. You know what? Mewtwo regular rare. Not worth being treated like a regular rare. I'm still going to put it to the side, but it's good pull. This is <laughs> the last chest though, guys. If any example has ever led me to one thing, it's that these pulls are about to be off the absolute chain. Let's go water type energy, pig knight, Zangoose as well. We're gonna gloom, pimplop, volpix, rock rock, a stuffle with a tummy ache, rowlet, and then look at this! It's the baby's GX! This is gonna be the tin, guys. This is so gonna be the tin! Okay, baby's GX card right there. Baby's artwork. Surely that is saying something. Oh gosh, don't let the poles fall down the back. There's the code. Hopefully those are the Rainbow Red Charizard ones. Fire type. Perfect summary of what's about to happen. Dartrix, Lily, Tangela, got a Dust Skull, and then Mimikyu Regular Rare. Is it all really down to the final three? The last team up. I mean, it's got Celebi and Venusaur. The two faves on the front. Is that going to be enough to save him? I hope so. We're going to Psyche type, Judge Whistle, then a Persian, Weedle, Helioptile, oh boys, Ferroseed, Meowth, Nidoran, a Lolan Muck regular rare. I bought all my eggs in one basket by saying you guys are good. You can't let me down right now. Jeez, these Guardians Rising are so stuck together. It's crazy. All right, put you to the side, and that's it. Second to last booster of the whole lot. We got a fairy type energy, Slowbro, Watchhog, Rescue Stretcher, Gothita, got a Volpix, Chansey, Petlil, Litwick. There's gotta be like a Charizard in here. And I I don't know. Something along those lines. Another Mewtwo full art. For all of this to be worth it. For these chests to come back and redeem itself. I would have said that those cosmic have sort of let me down a bit, but. I think if we get a Charizard here, it's gonna be okay. Seal, Nidoran, Ponida, Doduo, Pikachu, Charizard Spirit Link, that's surely hinting towards something, and then... I feel like that's the Tim's way of giving me a subtle uppercut. You know guys, when I look at it like this and I've laid out all of the Pokemon cards, it actually was a really, really cool opening. I mean, you're just gonna look at this absolute monstrosity and think, you know what? It's actually pretty good. Like, no matter what, even if you get the Pokemon chest right, you're guaranteed this absolutely epic Armored Mewtwo full art. Then you also get the Clone Charizard Holo card and the Holo Pikachu right there. All of it done in the CGI, the same as the movie, and it's really cool. So, like, at minimum, you're guaranteed three of those. And because we opened up nine tins, oh my goodness, we've got this many cards. So I guess, like, I look at the, right here, the pulls that we got this episode as a bit of a bonus. I mean, whatever happened here was whatever happened here. And dude, we got a full art flipping Mewtwo with all the texture, the gold border. Then we got a couple of really sick GX cards. I mean, especially Mega Charizard EX as well. That's a banger. Tap at Lele. Then we got a couple of reverse full arts. The break card's a bit 50-50. And we only got two holo cards, which is pretty cool. So we definitely made up for the holos right here. And we also got nine of the Chibi Mew art formed coins right here, which is pretty sick. But yeah, that was basically the whole recap of all nine chests. What do you guys reckon? I got a feeling you guys are going to be a bit, uh, I don't know, hit or miss with these things. If you really love them, you really love them like me, or maybe you're a bit 50-50 on them. I'm keen to know. Um, definitely leave a comment in the comment section below. What sort of pulls did you get? And should I do a giveaway with a couple of these cards right here? Which one do you want the most? Full Up Mewtwo, Clone Charizard, or Pikachu? For most of all, guys, hopefully you enjoyed today's video. Definitely demolish the like button if you did. Thanks again to Chaos Cards. Definitely check them out with the link in the description. But most of all, gonna keep on gaming. Alright guys, next time, I'll see you then.